Well, hello, everybody, and good morning. This is the Lifelong Blog Blog Challenge. My name is Bud, and I trust that if you have, well, I trust that you are getting much benefit out of actually putting into practice the things that we have learned, that we, well, should have learned during the preparation phase, and since then have implemented and are continuing to learn, to build upon that foundation that was laid in that period. Uh, if you have not yet begun, then I would certainly encourage you to do so, uh, not for me. Um, you know, I'm getting the benefit of implementing myself, but for you and for those individuals who you have either already brought into your business or those individuals whom you will bring and for those individuals uh, who uh, the people you bring in will bring in. You have to have something to offer to add value. We, we hear that term, you know, adding value, contributing having something of worth to pass on, pass down, pass along, and if you don't have it, you cannot give it. <laughs> does, does that make sense? Okay, so if whatever skills you possess currently that you came in with or that you have since developed, those skills need to be perfected and you need to uh, add more. <laughs> and that process, the process of honing the skill set you currently uh, possess and Increasing in all those areas and adding more areas is a lifelong endeavor. Uh, the sooner you get started, the further along the road you will be in all of those areas, however you choose to break them down. And the more you will have to give in order to take your people further along than what they are. You cannot take the people uh, further than what than what you have gone yourself. That's not to say that you or someone in your downline is not going to bring somebody in uh, who possesses skills greater than yours. Of course, you will have had little to do with their success, um, so much so that they're probably going to pass you up, <laughs> okay? And so earnings that they will earn, you're only going to get a percentage of, you know, of, of their labors up until the point that they either match where you are or surpass, uh, or surpass you. I think that's how a uh, number or probably even most of the network marketing pay plans uh, pay out. So you want to be as far along as you possibly can, as soon as you can. Um, not just so folks, you know, coming in won't pass you sooner. That's that's a benefit, but so that you'll be in a position to be able to help raise people up to. Uh, whatever level you are at, okay? So talk to your upline, 
uh, within your team and find out what you need to be doing to do that and always be adding uh, in addition to that from whatever other sources that do not conflict or take away from whatever it is your team slash upline is, uh, is got going. Okay, so anyway, uh, that's enough. Uh, typing the results for today, 43 words per minute, 13.4 error percentage in a time of 8 minutes, 24 seconds. So, that is it. We have the Repair Cafe uh, this morning, and so we are off and running for that. If you don't know what Repair Cafe is, look it up. It's a neat, neat uh, thing that allows uh, people, volunteers, in wherever you happen to be, to get together to repair other people's uh, lamps and, and things that need to be sewn and sharpening of tools and electronics, computers, uh, woodworking, uh, all that kind of stuff. People come to the repair cafe, the volunteer coaches is what they call them, uh, the people who bring the things needing fixed cannot simply drop them off. They have to remain with their item and uh, be engaged with the repair person or persons and actually uh, be you know, learning about you know how that things can be fixed. You don't have to run out, you know, discard the, the item and, and run out and buy a new one uh, every every single time. Now some things can't be fixed and, and you know in that case, yeah, you might have to, but um, you know, there's there's you know awaken people to the notion that things can be fixed, number one. And two, begin them uh, the learning process of, you know, how to think and how to approach. Uh, you know, from the simple to the more complex, but, um, you know, they begin learning. Uh, the more times they come with, you know, different things, they, 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 they gain an understanding, and it's a terrific place for children uh, to come and begin that process at a ripe young age. Uh, just so many, uh, uh, not to mention the social aspect of, you know, getting out and getting to know others within your community, uh, networking, okay? You don't have to go, you know, tackle everybody and tell them about your business, uh, you know, first time you encounter them, but uh, just, you know, meet people, uh, develop relationships, and, you know, when the timing's right in conversation as it naturally unfolds, uh, you're going to learn things about people, and some of those people, your deal is going to be able to help them, not all of them. Okay, not everybody is dissatisfied, and of those who are dissatisfied, not everybody wants to be helped. Okay, some people, if they if they didn't have something to complain about, they'd be complaining about that. Okay, so, um, but you know, some people are going to be uh, dissatisfied. They're going to have wants and needs and don't want that. Um, coming on board as a representative in your outfit uh, really genuinely can help them. So let's get out there. Let's um, make friends. Let's, um, let's uh, introduce uh, to those individuals uh, who are a good fit to the business uh, and, uh, and uh, genuinely improve their lives uh, or at least uh, you know, have that as your, as your as your purpose for being, uh, and of course, you know, have the skill sets to uh, be able to help them along in order to give them every chance to be successful. You can't make them do anything, uh, but you can create, you can foster an environment where, where uh, being successful is the likely outcome if people will do, okay? Okay, so we're out of here. Um, this is Bud. We're looking forward to the next time that we can spend time together. Hopefully, that will be as soon as tomorrow. But if not, then hopefully sooner than later. But in either case, until then, we are out of here. 
Take care.